Hello, golf friends. Can you have too fast of a swing? We're going to talk about that today on Tour Swing Tuesday. Hi, this is Gary Bates from the Gary Bates Golf Academy. I'm a PGA teaching professional and certified V1 video analysis coach. So great to have you along. Hey, if you're a new subscriber, welcome. Great to have you as part of the community. And if you've been with us a while, well, we appreciate you so much. And we hope these videos help you and encourage you in your game. Okay, so up here, Victor Hodlin, 24 years old, working his way up the world rankings, now fourth. Let's take a look at this action and see what we can learn. And of course, always enjoy your comments at the bottom of what you think. So in the setup with the driver, obviously, nice knee flex, arms hang down, maybe a little further out than I see with some players, uh, but good tilt from the hips and, uh, you know, very athletic position weighing the balls of feet, A+. plus. Okay, into motion right here. He's going to take this club back, and we got a beautiful blue background there, Carolina blue, huh? Um, and so going back, you know, that 1 o'clock position with the face, right? So that's pretty typical, I'd say, of most tour players um, and very fine. Now, what's a little unusual here, unique, I would say, is his right leg uh, starts to lock or straighten at this point. Now, typically I see that move a little bit later uh, with tour players, most of the folks I teach, if they get a lock this early, they wouldn't get their weight to the right side. But he happens to be able to uh, do that. Although when you look at him from the face-on angle, his lower body really goes to the target pretty quickly as he gets back, even in this position. So a little unique there. Okay, turning to the top, right? Very good motion right here. Uh, got that club, you know, fairly deep, I would say. Sorry, it's a little blurry here. Not the best video, but shows us enough. Um, his hand's very deep, so... If you drew a straight line down from the club, be off his right heel. That's good. I like that overall. Uh, but then you're going to see him kind of lift the club a little bit. Not a problem, I don't think. You see this with a lot of two-planers. Um, but what do you notice there? Quite a shut club face, right? Pointing to the sky, and his left wrist is bowed. Now, if you got this position, be encouraged. And sometimes as a teacher, I say, you know, gosh, should I change this or not? I think you're just fine with this. If you get in this position, many tour players have played for this position and played well. And by the way, Victor Hovlin is playing great and is a tremendous driver of the ball with this position. I mean, he is high in total driving, you know, the, the accuracy and the distance combined. So he's long and straight. And I recommend that to you if you can do it. Okay, so dropping it down right here. So hands drop, club drops down with it, right? And he gets into a very good position here where he starts to flatten the club really parallel and slightly above the original shaft line plane. Um, and what do you notice there? Wow, look at that head really dropping, right? That compression of the ground. And look at the knee flex. Wow, so really using a ground, the ground as a, as a force, right? Um, and also, along the ways of uh, the swing speed, he's got a very fast swing, right? Very fast tempo. And if you have that fast swing, I want to encourage you that that's just okay, <laughs> Right. I mean, you think over the years in the in the game of golf and the great players. And I think of two that come to mind that had very fast swings, Hubert Green and Lanny Watkins. Now I'm dating myself, but some of you that watch this will understand. They had really fast swings, but they had great sequence. So that's what I think is the secret, folks. Not necessarily the swing speed, but the sequence. A lot of S's there. OK, so what's that mean? Lower body starts like in this position. You can't see his left knee. Right, it's gone, and the club is only, he's only parallel to the ground with his left arm. So it's sequence. I don't think you swing too fast, too hard. You get better sequence. Okay, dropping it down, right? Getting on the original shaft line plane, a little two for one right there. Look at this amazing rotation of his hips and his body, right? Looks like Lee Trevino almost here, right? Right elbow back to his side and really down through the hitting area. And he's got a very stable face. So again, if you have a shut club face position at the top, you're not going to need as much face rotation, which overall is a, you know, a pretty good move to make, I would say. Then getting into the follow through, really around his body a lot, right? Almost back on the original shaft line plane. So quite an around follow through and then up on the right toe. But, you know, just a beautiful motion with Victor playing so great. We wish him the very best moving forward. Great to see young folks come out the tour and just really play way well. So hope you enjoyed this video. Hey, if you like one, we can do one for you. So easy to do with the V1 app. You can send it in and I can send it back with voiceover analysis like this. Just click the link below to get started. Be sure to click that subscribe button. Join the community. We have a lot of fun and we love for you to be a part of it. So God bless you. See you next time on Tour Swing Tuesday. Bye for now.